Hello there. As you can see here, I have made a remote controller and I am controlling a simple two wheel robot with this. This is a ESP 12V based remote controller. We can navigate a robot or control some circuit using this tiny remote controller. Also, we can receive and see the sensor or other parameters of the receiver on the OLED screen. In this video, let's see how to make this. I decided to build our remote controller just like a game controller, so I used this image to design the controller. Here I used ECDA to create the circuit. The main component of this circuit is this ESP12V. Then I have added the OLED display and buttons for navigation. You can find the circuit diagram from the video description. Then I converted the circuit diagram into a PCB. Here I designed the PCB just like the game board and here is the end result. After that I downloaded the Gerber files for PCB fabrication. I chose JLC PCB for fabricating the PCBs because they offer only $2 for 5 PCBs and their PCB assembly starts from $0. Ordering the PCBs from JLC PCB is also easy. Just click on order now and upload the Gerber file. After uploading the Gerber file, we can select the quantity, color, thickness, etc. Then we can place our PCB order. After one week, I received the pack from JLC PCB. Here is the PCBs from JLC PCB. Everything is nice and the quality is awesome. Now let's grab all components and let's start the soldering. First I have soldered the SMD components. Then I have soldered the THT components. Finally, I placed the 128 by 64 OLED and here you can see the finished PCB. Looking good, right? The brain of this project is this ESP 12V that means we can access Wi-Fi and ESP now communication. Here I am going to use the ESP now communication. If here is the first code and I just uploaded to test the circuit. I used the DIY ESP 12V programmer to upload the code just like this. You can watch the ESP 12V programmer video from here. So as you can see the circuit is working without any problem. Now let's test the ESP now communication. Here I have made a simple node MCU circuit which consists of 4 LEDs. And we are going to control these LEDs with our remote. After uploading code to the controller and node MCU, you can see the working. Here is the simple two-wheel robot that I just made for testing the ESP now communication. And see, I am controlling it with our new ESP remote controller. Finally, in the remote, I am reading the data from the receiver section. I will make a separate video for this and the robot in Zoom. So stay with us. Everything is tested and the circuit is working perfectly. You can download the circuit from my site. Link is in the video description. So that's all about today. Hope you got some new ideas and learned something new from my video. If so, consider supporting me by liking, sharing and subscribing. That's all up to you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.